Hello there everybody, Spice Cabinet here and we are playing Pokemon Trading Card Game Pocket today. Pokemon TCG Pocket. It is a very newly launched game, I know. And it is absolutely beautiful. It's just beautiful. Um, I'm going here so that you don't see my cards. Um, this is absolutely from the lowest rarity, rarity to the highest rarity, ascending order. But we have one, we can open a 10 pack. Um, we can select a 10 pack opening right now, so I'm gonna do right that. Um, I'm gonna go open the Charizard one, because that is what I need right now. I want that Charizard EX. You, if you, I'll show you what the card looks like. Um, it's an absolutely beautiful card. It's it's this. It's this. It's this. Um, you see the three stars there? I don't think you can see my taps, but you see the three stars there. 0.222%. That's what I want. 0.13% um, would be alright as well, but the thing is, I don't like the art of that, those cards. I like the art of these cards, even though the, the golden cards are really more rare. Um, it's a 10 pack. We've got 123. It'll take exactly 119. And we're gonna do it right now. Let's see how it goes. This is the first time I've ever played Pokemon TCG Pocket on my channel, um, and this is gonna be a uh, this is gonna be a card showcase as well, the November card showcase of my account. Um, double because we've got 50 packs, 50 cards. We're gonna do it slow. Double Charmander, nice Gloom, Lapras. That's beautiful. We already have them. The Abra, Sizzlebead, Psyduck. Rimsicott and Chinchino. Ah, that's bad. Too bad. Pack 3. Tangela. Sabrina. Nice. Ducklet. Gullet. And Starmie. That's... That's some trash out right there. I'll tell you that. More wild. Charmander. Vile Plume. That's like we already had Plume. I don't... I don't know if we do have Orish or not. I don't know. I don't know. Oh my god. <laughs> okay. One of the beautiful cards that out there. Lapras. One star. There's one star, there's two stars, there's three stars, and there's crown. Rarity, the, the, the rarest cards in the game. Uh, now we go Weeping Bell, Machop, Hidden of Jan, Corny, Sand Slash. Card pack six. Artist, oh, nice. So we have, already have Green Team, good Green Team. Heatmore, Wimsicott, Tauros, huh? I, I already have had it. Charmanian, Ratata, Proki, Hidden Chan, Pinner, Pin Crooked. I already have Three of those having Kabuto, have them, Dicklet, now, Tangela. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Okay, okay. More trees. Um already had him. Already had him. Um Pack 9, Eevee, Go Ghost, Frost Not, Far Frost. Oh my god, stop me as well. Had him already. Four stars, four diamonds. Come on, this is the final pack. You have to give me. Come on. I I spent so much. Oh my fucking god. Oh no! No! Why? Fuck this, man! <clears throat> Damn! Ah! <sighs> Didn't get the card we wanted, which was a three-star thingy. Yeah, we, I have five fifty something cards already. I don't know. I no one. This is the, this is the Pokedex. So out of two twenty-six, I have got one sixty-six collected. That's nice. And you are. You already saw the cards that I have. Anyway, let's go to the rarity thingy. I show you all the cards that I have. Um, you can see all of them right here. These are all one diamond rarities. I mean, I call it diamond. I don't know what it is. Pikachu. Uh, this is my electric team. Pikachu, Blitzel, Tatamo, Helioptile, Heliolisk. And I, I'm not a psychic team. I've got routes. Psychic deck, not team. Um, Meltan, I want its evolution, I forgot the name of its evolution. Dome Fossil, I really you uh, the Dome Fossil is useful because I have a great use for it. Charmanian, Nine Tails, Rapidash. How many do we have Charmanian? Two, okay. That's nice. We've got electric. Electric, not electric, electric. For Gadea, Frostmoth. Frostmoth is a good uh, water type as well. Zerb Striker. Pin I don't know why the fuck this. I don't know why I have them. Kill, uh, we've got Killia. We've got the whole Valve Evolution line. It's really useful in a psychic team. 
You will see why I have a psychic team in the first place. Taurus, Erica, Vlaine, Giovanni and Sabrina. And from here start the three diamond cards. And I think we should show for, showcase from this three star rarity. Uh, Venusaur. An alright Pokemon. Takes too much energy for too little damage in my opinion. Sharp Sting. Then we've got Wild Bloom Soothing Scent. Oh, asleep. Huh, that's nice. Charizard as well. Too much damage. But, I mean, it's a toll. Like, too fire energy is as bad. Um, Flareon Flamethrower. I have never used this card before. And I have how many? Three of them. Can I get a Flare? Oh, I can. I will get a Flare then. If I can take, if I can get a flare, then I will get a flare. Though. I've got tens of thousands of um, what do you call this? Uh, Twelve thousand shites. I forgot what. I don't know. I don't really focus on the flares in this game. Then we've got more trees. 130, Sky Attack, Flip a Coin, if Tails is the act, there's nothing. That's very sad. Lapras, Hydro Pump, if this Pokemon has at least 3 energy attached, this attack does 70 more damage. 3, what energy? Then Articuno, Ice Beam, Flip a Coin, if your heads, if your heads, your opponent active, opponent's active Pokemon is not paralyzed. I don't use these cards at all. Electros, that's beautiful. Thunderfang, 80, if your, if Flip a Coin, if heads, your opponent's active Pokemon is not paralyzed. That's, that's a good team right there. Then we've got Gengar, but th this attack is also amazing. Um, can't use supporter cards. Now, then we've got Gardevoir. Absolutely a blessing for psychic, for a psychic deck. It, you can tell, you can um, do this, you can use Psy Shadow, its ability once every turn, and you can add one psychic energy to your active card, and uh, active Pokemon, and that is extremely useful when you have the main damage dealer Mute. Um, then we've got Kabutops, Leech Life, um, Heal, so does 50 damage, heals 50 damage. That's beautiful. Then we've got Muck. So, the strategy I use in my Dark Deck uh, is I send Grimer, if I get Grimer. I send Grimer, I use its base attack, which poisons and causes like 30 or 20 damage. And then, I Evolve, I, I hold the dark um, energy and then I use, uh, then I evolve and then I use Mox Venoshock which gives 120 damage if your, your Pokemon is poisoned. Yeah, the, the opponent's Pokemon is poisoned, that's amazing. Weezing, if your Pokemon is in the active spot, you may make your opponent's active Pokemon poison. Weezing is a little too hard, but the damage is too low. I mean, I can actually use this in correspondence with um, Mox as well, just Put him, retreat, then put him. That's, that would be amazing. Dragonite, I don't have Dragonair. I have Dratini, I don't have Dragonair. So that is really important for me. Draco Meteor, it takes two very... So the Dragon type's limitations are that it takes two varied um, energy types. So it's, it's really difficult. I mean, it's all based on luck in the battle. Pidgeot, Drive Off, this is amazing. This is amazing. You just send your active, your opponent's active Pokemon on the bench and switch. Beautiful. Now we have Ditto. Choose one of your opponent's Pokemon attacks and use it as an attack. This attack does nothing. That's the thing. Depends upon how much energy this guy has. Then we start with the four diamond rarity cards that I have. It's it's coming. It's coming. The rarest card of mine is coming. Venusaur EX. So, Razor Leaf and Giant Bloom, 30 damage, 30 heal, 100 damage, amazing thing. Um, there's no limitation, as such. The only rule is that yeah, when the EX Pokemon gets knocked out, your opponent gets two, two points, and you only need three points to win a duel. So yeah, not, not really that great. It's, it's a risk, it's a risk. You put an EX card when you're sure that you can fucking take the opponent down. Or, when you have no choice, uh, or when you have no choice, that, that, that's what happens with me mostly. Then executor, tropical swing. Really, really, 
I'd say all based on luck team if you got executor as your main you are running on luck and it requires only one energy that's really great but it requires three energy to routine I don't understand why because he's the X and all the X cards have three stars and that maybe I don't know but it's still it's like you really really have to go on the weakness and then you have to, like target the weakness of the other Pokemon you have to be Rely on luck too much. Then we've got Starmie, Hydro Splash. Quite simple. Where's the retreat option? Where well, it can retreat how times? What the fuck? Okay, I didn't know that. Articuno, you know? you've got two. Ice Wing and Blizzard. I like the Blizzard attack of this guy. So yeah, his water type. He is a water type team. My water type team is built around this guy. It's it's really amazing. Text. Marowak EX as well, all based on luck, flip two coins, if you get both tails then you're fucked, if you get both tails then you, it's gone, 160, even if the open does an EX Pokemon, it's gone. Then we've got Bulbasaur, um, this is where the one star Pokemon start, special art, special, um, what do you call this, holo cards, I mean these were holo cards as well but these are special ones. Vine Whip 40, there's nothing to say about this. Um, Gloom as well, special level cards. These are all rare cards that I have. Gyarados, Hyper Beam, this card random energy. I haven't really added him to my water type team. I haven't really added him to my water type team because I don't have Magicka. As simple as that. Then we move on to Lapras, we got him just now. Beautiful. Yeah, it's. It's the same. So 70 damage. So total it can get is 90 damage. That's not too great. Then we move to Slowpoke. Amazing. On oh, it is amazing on the uh, Psychic Team. Can't be your main damage dealer. Slowbro. Then Cubone, Growl. So this is really helpful in the starting point, starting rounds, turns of your uh, duel. Because if you your Pokemon your opponent has sent a base card, base Pokemon card, and mostly he's gonna do like 20 damage, and if you and or 30 at max. So if you just use Growl, your opponent is not gonna cause any damage to you. It's amazing. Then Pidgeot, amazing card, beautiful, one of my favorites. Drive off again, wing attack, basic things. Then we've got Meowth, Pere, draw a card. As simple as that. Basic Pokemon, we do 10 damage and we draw a card. That's it. Polygon data scan once during your turn, you may look at the top card of your Pokemon of your deck. It will help when you are a very strategic person and you really wanna know what other what card is gonna come next in your hand so that you can set up the other items and everything around it. And then we go to more trees. You've got two of these. That's nice. We just got it right now. Uh, I could have actually got it this, you know. But I need one more of this. And this is one of the most beautiful cards I've ever seen. Let me tell you that. It's just phenomenal. It looks beautiful. And its ability is also nice. Inferno Dance. It's it's a blessing to have this Pokemon on your team um, when. We have a fire deck, and you put him on, act on the active spot, you give him one energy, and you let him do Inferno Dance all the time. Three, um, it'll give you three chances. If you, each, uh, for each round of heads, um, a fire energy will attach, it will be attached to a bench, a bench Pokemon, whatever, whichever Pokemon you want. I think it's getting near. Only two cards are left to show, and one of those two are my favorites. Mewtwo. EX, beautiful card, beautiful card. These are the two stars. All the two star stars from this special ones. Absolutely beautiful. Psychic Sphere, Side Drive. This is my main tech. Okay, this is my main card. My main Pokemon. I send him. I first of all, I send some other Pokemon. Then I, I but I, if I have this, then I'm gonna send him on the actors spot. Then I have got Ralt, I put Ralt on the bench, then I use Krillia, Evolve, then 
it takes three turns so it takes a while but when you have got everyone on your bench and when you have Mewtwo on your active spot you are unbeatable literally unbeatable there's only a few Pokemon that will fucking be able to protect themselves from your attack it's 150 damage and very less Pokemon have more than 150 HP even Mewtwo itself if the opponent is Mewtwo then it's just a turn base game. And then, a rare card ever. A three star one. Oh shit! Fuck! I, I forgot that I had something. I was wondering where she was. Amazing thing. I never thought that I would get a supporter card, which would be this beautiful. It's amazing. And, and she also helps a lot in the psychic team, or any team, to be honest. It just switches the opponent's active Pokemon with a bench Pokemon, which they have to choose. And then, guys, whatever card up to date, the three-star Mewtwo EX. It might look not too brilliant, but it is really, really special. It doesn't have a holo. It's not 3D, but it has this. It's beautiful. It's beautiful. I was fucking. Jumping around when I got this card, I'm telling you this. Music as well, it's amazing. Well, you Pokemon fans know what this is. He's just escaped from the lab, basically. That's where this card is from. It's amazing, it's amazing. And the card which I wanted was the Charizard of the same rarity, a 3 star Charizard. I show you, there will be community, sh community showcases where you'll be able to see a 3 star Charizard somewhere. There we go. This is it. This is what I want. It's absolutely beautiful. It's absolutely fucking beautiful. Music as well. Every Pokemon out there from Generation 1. Venusaur. Pidgeot with Pikachu on it. Gyarados and Dragonite fighting Fury out there. I don't know why this was. But who's this? A oh, one sorry. And Psyduck. Amazing thing. Oh, this giant one looks so beautiful, to be honest. And then there's the Pikachu of that. So, oh my god, look at this bitch. Yeah, this guy is a pain to win. For sure. But I don't like these. I don't like this. It's too fucking weird, honestly. I don't like these. Giovanni is amazing. He looks good. But he doesn't. he's not a good supporter. He just gives 10 plus damage. I mean, it is... When you are... At that moment, which if it isn't break or make deal, then it's useful, but it's not. Like, really, it's not that useful. Um, in uh, not useful in the early stages, or when you just dominated the game. I don't see the Pikachu card anyway. I don't know why. This should be. I. This guy is my friend. What the fuck? I did not know that. I should like them. Why won't I? They're my friends, bro. Um, I don't see the Pikachu, uh, Pikachu card. There's a Pikachu card, um, the same as the Charizard and the Mewtwo I showed you. It's amazing. Well, you've seen my cards for now, and now I'll show you my binder. Beautiful art. This is my binder right here. Looks nothing special, but to be honest, I love this card set of mine it's amazing well that was the card showcase for november 2024 um i will do one more next month so yep um wait what the fuck do i oh the fuck i didn't i didn't know that i could get that what the fuck okay anyway um oh oh shit i could do that as well i had no idea 
the fuck? That's how you get. Oh my god. That's how you get likes on your fucking. I did not know that. Shit. Anyway. You're done, you're done here. Thank you for watching. Leave a like if you like the video. Subscribe to my channel if you're new. And if you play Pokemon TCG, consider adding me as your friend. I am right here, Spice Cabinet. Um, I don't. I don't know how to share. Oh, there you go. Friend ID is right up there in the corner. 5407-8774-4740 and 8372. That's a friend ID. So, yep. Yeah, I will be ending the video here. Thank you for watching again. Subscribe to the channel. Like the video if you like uh, if you liked it, and I'll meet you in the next video or today itself on stream tonight. Bye bye.